but everybody shows up for each other. Everybody like accepts each other. There's just this deeper level of connection that exists um, in like every relationship dynamic when um, Lewis actually meets the Robinsons um, a- after the first act. Yeah. You know, I think playing on our conversation about friends and what, what we liked so much about Big Hero 6 is we're seeing that in this family system, right? So this really throws a wrench in my comment about, right, sometimes we need to depart family to, to seek friends who can really kind of be where we want to be. This is a family that fosters connection. This is a family that, that makes so much space for everybody. doesn't matter who you are, what you're into, what you're doing. You're you, and that's beautiful, and we love that. And then that's what I've taken away from this movie every time I've watched it. That there's this level of accept- as soon as they find out that Lewis um, is in an orphanage, and the family's like, "Oh, we should adopt you. Like we need to accept," which would be an impulsive decision, I would say, if it's <laughs> the the real world. But being that open to saying that we value family so much, everyone deserves family, and yeah. just accepting them in. Um, I think everyone being so fundamentally different. But apply, especially when like the house is under attack by the dinosaur, <laughs> which this sounds like if you've not seen this, this sounds like so ridiculous, but mm-hmm. it, it, and it is. But like they all start taking care of each other, right? Yes. Um, and then I think one of my favorite scenes is when Lewis tries to fix something, mm-hmm. and then it doesn't work, and he starts immediately going into his shame spiral of, "I'm stupid. I can't yeah. do this. Nothing I do ever works." Mm-hmm. And everyone jumped in to support him and was like it's okay, like, you learn, like, this is a great thing. Like, there was no shame. There was just nothing but, like, acceptance in failure. Yeah. You know, it's, they step in and they creatively create, I'm, I'm going to butcher that word, um, but they come in and they foster their creative uh, nature, right? They yeah. go, well, they all look at what ways it can be done. They all talk about what sparks from here, right? And what, what is that? Um, and, I don't know if it's ever quoted correctly. The Edison quote about he didn't fail like 99 times. He just figured out not how to yeah. make a light bulb 99 times. And that's kind of the attitude that they present. They say, you're being you. They're saying that this is part of the process and that's okay. Right? I guess what they did um, to kind of call back, they took out the expectations. But more importantly, they softened the expectations he had for himself to get him out of the shame spiral. And they also said that we don't expect anything, anything outside of who you are. And I, I want to make sure that we go back to what you said about how everybody deserves a family. Um, everybody deserves a loving and open family. Because I think that sometimes we get into this toxicity, right? Where it's a, you know, where people use family as a weapon. And I hate that. Yeah. And I love that this movie takes that away. Absolutely.